to the news in details now, the governor of the Central Bank of the Gambia, Honorable Boa Sedi, has said preliminary estimates show that the government physical operations has resulted in an overall deficit of 9.3 billion in the first half of 2024. Maria Madem has more in this report. The Monetary Policy Committee of the Central Bank of the Gambia recently met to review the Gambia's current economic situation and decided to maintain the monetary policy rate at 17% in an effort to sustain the declining inflation trend observed in recent months. Speaking at a press conference on Tuesday, the Governor of the Central Bank of the Gambia disclosed that preliminary estimates shows that the government fiscal operations resulted in an overall deficit of $9.3 billion in the first half of 2024 compared to 8 Point nine billion recorded in the corresponding period of 2023. Despite this deficit, Governor Sedi went on to say that the Gambia economy grew by 4.8% in 2023 and is forecasted to grow by 5.7% in 2024, supported by public and private investment spending, household consumption and a rebound in tourism. Preliminary estimates of government fiscal operations indicate an overall fiscal deficit excluding grants of $9.3 billion, or 6.5% of GDP, in the first half of 2024, compared to a deficit of $8.9 billion, or 6.2% of GDP, recorded in the corresponding period of 2023. Similarly, the overall budget deficit, including grants, amounted to $5.1 billion, or 3.9% of GDP, in the first half of 2024, higher than the $4.8 billion, or 3.3% of GDP, reported in the same period of 2023. Business confidence has seen a slight improvement with most respondents expecting economic activity to expand in the coming months, he said. However, concern remain about inflation with businesses expecting a further rise in inflationary pressures in the near term. This business sentiment survey for the second quarter of 2024 indicated a slight improvement in business confidence. Most resp respondents expected economic activity to expand over the next three months. Despite this optimism, businesses remain concerned about inflation, with a significant portion of businesses surveyed, expect, surveyed expecting a further rise in inflationary pressures in the near term. Looking ahead, the continuous the continuous decline in inflation is expected to stabilize. According to the central bank boss, the banking industry remains stable with positive financial indicators such as an expanded asset base and increased customer deposit. At the same time, he added, the industry's non-performing loans have increased to 10.2% in June 2024 from 8.7% in March 2024. The industry continues to be stable will with healthy financial soundness indicators. The industry asset base expanded by 18.1% in June 2024 to stand at $96.2 billion compared to $88.6 billion reported in March 2024. Similarly, Total customer deposits, which continue to be the main source of funding for banks, increased by 6.3% quarter on quarter to stand at $62.6 .6 billion as of June 2024. Governor Sedi also reported that inflation in the domestic economy has been decreasing, with headline inflation declining to 9.7% in July 2024, down from 14.9% in March 2024. Food and non-food inflation rates have also decreased, showing a positive trend in pricing, he added. He said the central bank anticipates that inflation will continue to decline towards the target of 5% by the end of 2024. It was broad-based with a fall in both food and non-food inflation. Food inflation 
decelerated to 13.0% in July 2024 from 14.4% in June 2024 and 20.3% in March 2024. The easing of food inflation reflects moderation in, ma ma in ma major components in the food basket, including a deceleration in the price indices of bread and cereals, fish, vegetables, fruits, and nuts. Non-food inflation stands at 5.5% in the review period on change from June 2024 figure, but lower than the 8.7% reported in March 2024. The Monetary Policy Committee has decided to maintain the current monetary policy rate at 17% to support the disinflation process. The committee will also continue to monitor developments in both the domestic and global economy to inform their future policy decisions. The next MPC meeting is scheduled for November 27, 2024, with the policy decision announcement to follow on November 28, 2024. Maria Madem, reporting for Stativi News.